Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video guys to any of you having a Hyundai Santa Fe. If you guys have a Hyundai Santa Fe, you have engine light on in any of the following codes, such as code P03403413423 or 344. Stay with us, we'll explain what most likely causes each of these codes and how to fix it guys. Uh, now, it will be demonstrating on the 2.4 GDI engine that has been used guys in multiple models. Uh, Hyundai vehicles, the uh, engine is out of the car so we can show you with the great detail we'll be fixing things and taking the whole engine apart but you don't need to remove your engine so uh, we'll demonstrate what causes these codes and how to fix it so make sure to stay until the end so this should work on Hyundai Santa Fe generation 2013 all the way to year 2016 guys with a 2.4 GDI engine. Now let me introduce you to the channel quick. Every single car we get at the garage we try to make at least 2 to 300 free repair videos. We take them completely apart, we show you how to fix practically anything guys. Why we do all that? Simply because our mission in the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video. This engine, okay, will be completely taken apart, transmission will show we how to fix almost anything on it another thing if you need to buy any parts or tools guys okay check out the link in the description of the video below and you can see where we get all the tools and parts from for a really good price and quick shipping as well that's where we get all our supplies from so this right here okay this is the engine and uh, before we start let me tell you guys if you have a Hyundai with a 2.4 GDI engine or other cars check our main channel how to repair guys we have helped more than 110 million people guys we have information that can save you time thousands of dollars so let's start on it now so this is it guys 2.4 GDI engine that uh, can be found on a Hyundai Santa Fe now what we'll need to do remove the upper engine cover just grab and pull it out uh, before we continue let me tell you guys many of you constantly ask me in the comment section below which computer we use for diagnostics it is this one guys right here I'll put the link in the description of the video below it can pay itself off in one time use it works on almost any car you can think of Hyundai is right here you can access every computer system read codes delete codes and see live data guys which makes it super convenient now looking guys at that engine this is your intake manifold that's what you need to find then the valve cover on the valve cover under this portion here we have the intake camshaft guys so we have a sensor that detects okay the movement of that camshaft for the timing variable timing and on the back side is the exhaust camshaft you need to locate the intake side this one here so looking at it guys you have that sensor right here we have the bolt removed it's underneath we have a video that explains how to remove and replace it but that sensor guys okay that sensor is super important because without that sensor your car may not run correctly may not run at all or it may have really poor performance the purpose of that sensor is for the variable timing for ignition for fuel and all that stuff so if you get any of these codes what to look for make sure guys the wiring harness is not broken this one here it's a little bit peeled but it's not broken make sure it's not loose okay let's grab it and I'll disconnect it quick okay we pull make sure you don't have oil sometimes leaking guys valve cover okay or you got it wet or something you can get oil or contaminate it clean the connector re-plug it okay in some cases you may remove the sensor and clean it if it's dirty on the outside and uh, reset the code and see if it comes back if if not guys we have a video that explains how to test the camshaft position sensor guys on a Hyundai and you will be able to find it on our YouTube channel auto repair guys please guys check it out so the, the most common reason for these codes okay bad connector not plugged connector or a bad camshaft position sensor on the intake side hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching and see you next time 